I would like to address the issue of Obamacare, which is before the Supreme Court. Today is the third and final day of oral arguments before the Supreme Court. And it's clear, uh, based upon the questioning from uh, Justice Kennedy and the others, that uh, there seems to be some real obstacles and some real hurdles uh, for Obamacare uh, being constitutional. The bottom line is, is what this law requires is the federal government requiring you to enter commerce, which is buying health insurance, and then penalizing you for that if you don't. Uh, as Chief Justice, not Chief Justice, but Justice Kennedy said, it changes the very concept. It changes the very fundamental uh, relationship between the federal government and individuals in this country. It's unheard of, and where it would end, nobody knows. I actually believe, although you never know what these justices might uh, be doing, that I could consider, I could admit, imagine a situation where the vote's unanimous uh, to find it unconstitutional. And Brown versus Board of Education, the landmark 1950s case relative to segregation in schools, Earl Warren, the Chief Justice, went to all the other justices and said, hey, this is too important for it not to be unanimous. And he won an unanimous vote from the court. And I think this is another uh, case uh, which might you know, do well to be unanimous. Regardless of that, it's going to be a close vote. If that's not the case, it'll be five to four. Uh, one thing that you need to understand is that when you know you're going to lose a vote, Sometimes it doesn't make any difference. You see that happen a lot in Congress where people will vote no or yes uh, when they know what the vote's going to be anyway. So anyway, it's going to be interesting. Uh, they've considered the issue of whether or not they can hear it at all uh, based on the tax issue. That seems pretty clear. The answer is yes. Then yesterday they heard the issue of whether or not there should be a mandate, whether that's constitutional. Today they're going to decide whether or not or hear argument whether or not uh, if they found the mandate unconstitutional, whether it's severable from the rest of the act. Obama himself has said that it doesn't work without the mandate, so that should be interesting. They're also going to address some of the issues relative to Medicare requirements. Bottom line is, let's hope Obamacare is found unconstitutional. This is the Bulldog. Every dog has their day. I hope tomorrow is yours.